In this video, I want to show you how you can edit your own stages within the sales pipeline and opportunities. First, you want to go to opportunities, and then you want to go to wherever you want to edit your stages. Doesn't matter where you enter this screen. So let's say I come to listings and appointments. From here, you're going to notice an edit stages button in the upper right hand corner. When I click on that, I have the ability now to edit these stages. So if I want to edit any, I can edit the stage. You'll also notice the checklist are built in here as well. So we're going to add a stage and add some checklist items. So if I add a new stage, I'm going to add this stage and I'm going to say rescheduled. In case I have to reschedule the appointment, I want that in my appointment stage. Now probability, this is your ability to say how much closer am I to hitting the fact that we have a deal, in this case listings, listing sold. Now in this case, I'm going to say rescheduled probably puts me back a little bit because we didn't actually keep our appointment. So I might move this rescheduled if meeting is a 30% probability, then I might just drop this back to 20%, keep it in position 5. Now here's my checklist, so adding a checklist item, I might want to confirm rescheduled appointment. Right, so I add that, hit the check mark here, add another item. I'll just add test two, check, add another item, test item three, check, add as many as you want. So, this is your ability to add a checklist to each stage. When you're done, you simply hit save, and now you'll notice I've got my stage number five is rescheduled in case we need to reschedule the meeting with a checklist of item of things to do and my probability score goes down after my meeting because if we're rescheduling, it's less likely they're actually getting closer to selling that listing and getting that listing. Now that's just one example. You can add this stage and do this process to any of the stages. You can also rearrange them by just simply clicking here and let's say I want to make this my number two stage. I can make that here. I can also drag it down and rearrange them. You can come back to any of these other ones like if I have a scheduled appointment, I might want to add a checklist item right here by clicking where it says items and I might just want to add confirm appointment as a checklist item. Check the box there, hit save and now anytime I move someone into that stage it adds a checklist for me. Well that's it, that's how you add stages. When you're done adding stages you just simply click here where it says sales pipeline and that takes you back. And now anytime I do my listings and I come to the appointment stage you'll notice I have scheduled, scheduling, kept, meeting and then rescheduled is now here just like I did and if I want to test it out I can move this person over to rescheduled and now notice it says three items in my checklist and I can come here and check them one two three close and now I've completed my checklist as well thanks so much for watching this video if you enjoyed it give it a like leave me a comment below I'd love to hear from you and as always follow me on KB Connect today